Welcome back everybody, today in this video we enter the second C. With lots of hardcore grinding and a bunch of tips from you guys, we made our way to the end of our first journey. Hope you guys do enjoy. Alright, so you guys told me that I should probably go and learn Dark Step at the place where Buggy is. Because one of you guys mentioned that in the last video and I totally looked over it. So I'm gonna have to go and find it. Alright, we made it to the island. Alright, now I believe you guys were saying it was like somewhere around here. Um, yes, right here, right here. Yo, that is just straight up Sanji. Yo, okay. Would you like to learn Dark Step for 150,000? Uh, Yes, please. Oh, shoot. Yo, what? You can aim it? Oh, shoot. And you guys were also telling me another thing I missed was the good cape that was in Marineford that one of the towers apparently has. So I'm gonna go over here and try and find it. I think one of you guys said it was in like with the right towers or like one of them at least. So I'm gonna go there and check it. All right, we made it. All right, so I'm gonna check this one first. Okay, there's nothing here. Is it this one? I don't see anything either. Maybe it's this one up here. Oh, I'm running out of energy. Oh, yes, it is. What the? This has got to be it. LOL, dude, I just bought this black cape for 100,000 Robux from some kid. He said it boosts my attacks and stuff. Want to buy it for 50,000, bro? Dude, fast. I got to go to church. What? Oh, shoot. I guess this is it. It doesn't look as good as the Marine one, in my opinion, or at least on my avatar, but at least it boosts something. It strengthens the wearer. Now that we got all the good stuff, I'm probably gonna head back to the prison and continue fighting the bosses over and over again until I level up enough, until I can fight the Magma Admiral. Oh, shoot. We got the pink coat. I don't know if I should wear the pink coat just because it looks like so cool or we should wear the black cape. You know what? Since you guys are telling me to wear the black cape, I'm going to wear it. And it also looks like it's a rare accessory versus an uncommon accessory. So it's got to be better, right? All right, we finally made it to level 350. So that means we're going to go ahead and head back to the magma village, which means I have to swim across the ocean again with the devil fruit. No, we were right there on the edge. Oh, we still spawned here anyway. Cool. To the Magma Village. All right, we made it. All right, the mayor. All right, Magma Admiral, here we go. Three million XP for this. Jeez. I have no idea where he's at. I assume at the top. Okay, in here. All right, this is the guy. This guy can't handle me. I don't know. Maybe he can. He's got me pretty low. Wow. Oh, shoot. I have to enable hockey. No, I got hit with that. That is so much damage. All right, here we go. Let's go. Level 356. That is insane. All right, I'm gonna try and boost my melee up a little bit more. All right, so that's my numbers right now. We're looking pretty good, I think. And what I think I'm gonna do is I'm probably just going to keep on server hopping for this guy as well until I get a high enough level for the next island, which I have no idea what the next island is. I assume it's probably 400. All right, let's get right to it. We got a refined musket? What the? No way, I just killed him with the musket. Oh my gosh. We got the new island, let's go. Find the NPC at the underwater city. This has gotta be Fishman Island for sure. I haven't upgraded my blocks fruits in a while, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it all on my blocks fruit. All right, to the underwater city. Now I did hear from one of you guys, I don't know if it was one of you guys or if I found it on YouTube or something, but I learned that the water kung fu is the best combat for first C at least. So I'm gonna try and buy that in hopes that it'll help my performance a lot more. I know Dark Step has been helping me so much with that fighting. I'm really excited excited to see what Fishman Island looks like. I've only seen the part to where you can actually go and buy the water kung fu move, but other than that, I have not seen Fishman Island at all. I didn't even realize, but I have a 500,000 berry bounty. Oh my gosh. I think we almost made it. Is that a whirlpool? All right, I'm gonna stop right here. I think we made it. I think we just go into this whirlpool. Oh, shoot. We're here. Let's go. No way. We're actually here. King Neptune. Oh, my gosh. It's King Neptune. We got Fishman Warrior, Fishman Commando, and Fishman Lord. I really hope Fishman Lord is actually Jean Bay. That would be sick. But I don't think I'm going to do the quest here. Just because I'm probably going to go back to the Magma Village and server hop for the boss. But I did want to come down here because I did hear about the Water Kong Fu move. And I think it's somewhere around here, maybe. I have no idea. Okay, this is it right here. I found it. I think it's through here 
Wait, I think this is Jean Bay. Is this supposed to be Jean Bay? Oh, shoot, for 750,000. Okay, here we go. We're buying it. We basically just learned Fishman Karate. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and head back. I don't know why I set my spawn point here. All right, so you guys were telling me to go ahead and head to the jungle. That way I can do the saber quest because it's like one of the best swords in the game to get. And it's pretty easy to get, I guess you guys were saying. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and do that. And I believe I can also get observation hockey after I unlock the saber or something like that and have to be level 300. I have no idea if I'm right on that, but... All right, I got that one. Okay, there's that one. There should also be another one right here. Yep. I'm literally just trying to go video by video to find them. All right, the fourth one's in here. Oh, nice. I got it. It's right here. Okay, I got it. I think that might have been all of them. I have no idea. Let's go check. All right, I don't know how to check. Okay, so I have to go to the center of the jungle. Got it. Got it. And then down here and then down here. Lands of the sand. My home does not stand. Now dark and grim. Bring light within. What? I have a torch now. Do I just like burn the door open? Do I do this? Oh, shoot. I have to go to the desert. No. All right, I'm supposed to take this torch to like one of the abandoned houses. I think it's like this one right here. Okay. Greetings. Do I like go through this? Is it gonna break? Oh, okay. If power you seek, fill the cup from a leak, left alone in the cold, is a story to be told. What the? I have a cup. Oh, wait! Is that from that one guy in the snowy village? All right, how do I fill it up? All right, time to go to the frozen village, I guess. Now the video is telling me to go in the cave and fill up the cup. All right, so if I stand right here, or, or right here. Okay, my cup's filled. All right, so now I have to give it to the sick man, which is right in here, I believe. Yup, here you go, kind sir. Thank you so much. Please meet up with my son. He will sure reward you. Okay, now I have to go back to the middle town, I think. Okay, this is pirate village. Never mind, this is not middle town. I believe I talked to this guy right here. Thanks for helping my father, but a mob leader has stolen all my money please find him and take him down as soon as possible so i can reward you all right so now i have to go to another island again which i think is literally right here all right so i gotta fight this guy okay this guy is light work holy crap yo this water kung fu does so much for just smacking him Jeez! All right, grab the money. Now I have to go back to the man. Thank you for getting my money back, but you can keep this ancient relic as a reward. Yo, what? So now I think I place it right here. Oh my gosh, we finally did it! Now it's time to fight Shakes. Here we go. Oh my gosh, he did so much damage. I'm trying to lure him out here. Come on, Shanks, you're better than this. Where'd Shanks go? Oh, he's right here. Never mind. Oh no, there's another person fighting him. Oh, this person's kind of helping me. What? He regained his health. No, he killed me. All right, I got my health back. We're cool. All right, he's so weak. No, but I still got the reward for it. I got saber. Now, I heard this is a really good sword, so I'm gonna try and use this as much as possible. Anyway, with all that out of the way, I'm, I'm gonna go back and fight the bosses. Let's go. Finally able to go and defeat the boss now. Let's go. To Fishman Island. All right, we made it. 4.2 million dang all right where's the guy at oh no oh no <laughs> it's not even g bay it's horty he don't want the smoke though like how are you gonna tell me that horty jones is a higher level than the magma admiral like what he transformed he drugged himself no this should be it let's go well it looks like i'm gonna be doing this over and over again we got the new island. Let's go. Find the NPC at the Skylands. Looks like we're going back to Skypea. Well, if we're going to the Skylands, that means we can go and get observation hockey from God Usopp, which will really help out our combat a lot. Or one of you guys was telling me that I can get observation hockey at the Skylands, so I'm gonna try and go there and see if I can find him. He made it! Skypea! So in reality, I should still be grinding for the bosses, but I need to go find God Usopp while I'm at it. God Usopp, where are you at? Okay, there's an arrow pointing down. How do we get here? I believe God Usopp should be in this tower. There he is. Hey, want to learn instinct? Yes, sir. Your instinct will be weak at first. What the? All right, we learned instinct. And with this guy, mind. Let's go. Level 500. All right, that should be what it takes to go to Skypea now. All right, we officially made it here. All right, time to fight the boss. Oh, yep, this is him. This is the guy from Skypea. All right, he don't want the smoke. Oh my gosh, it does over a thousand damage. That is insane. Let's go. That puts us at level 503. All right, I'm gonna keep on server hopping until I finally reach a high enough level. Let's go. We finally got a 1 million berry bounty. Let's go! I think we finally are able to go defeat the new boss. 
First, I gotta increase the stats, of course. All right, that's how we're looking at for stats right now. I've just been keeping my blocks for level 600, and then I've been increasing my melee and defense just to give him a chance, you know? All right, let's go. Defeat the Thunder God. I'm pretty sure this is Enel. This has to be an L. All right, where is he? Wait, is this him over here? It's an L, the one and only. Probably shouldn't mess around with this guy too much, so let's go ahead and enable observation hockey. Let's use our new Kung Fu move. Ooh, this guy's pretty good at close combat. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he killed me out of the air. I was not expecting that at all. Let's go, we got him. What is this? Spin fruit? Yeah, no thanks. Let's go! We finally reached level 676. Oh my gosh. That took so much grinding to get to. And our bounty is closer to 2 million now, standing at 1.6 million. That is insane. So we gotta go to the Fountain City, and I have a feeling I know who the boss is for this one because whenever we were at the prison and I had to swim to the Fountain City, there was Cyborg Frankie there. So, ooh, and we have 1.5 million dollars. Oh my gosh. Gosh. All right, we made it to the Fountain City. All right, defeat Cyborg Frankie. All right, here he is, Cyborg Frankie in the flesh, or should I say in the metal. Now, I did look it up. I think he might be the last boss that we have to face for the first C. Oh my gosh, he farted. There's no way I can take this seriously right now. Oh my gosh. Bro is actually farting. There we go. We finally defeated him. Couple more server hops and we should be on our way. Let's go! We reached 700! I think that's what it takes to get to the second C. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be going to the prison because you guys were saying that the guy that I talked to at the prison that said I had to be level 700, I'm pretty sure that's the guy I have to go to. So let's go! Alright, I believe it's this guy. Don Swan has escaped? We need help tracking him down before he takes over the world. My latest intel says that he's hiding with the... Ice Admiral? What? At the Frozen Village. Take this key and track him down. So we gotta go to the Ice Village? Why is he hanging out with Aokiji? What? Let me hop out of this thing. So is this key used for that door that's in the cave? So if I come in here, does that unlock this? It does. Oh my gosh, it's Aokiji. Do we have to fight Aokiji? All right, I'm sorry, Aokiji, but I gotta do this. Let's go! Well, I lost. That happens to the best of us. I'm assuming you were sent here because of my little encounter with Swan, right? I cannot say this the correct way. Justice changes based off of your perspective. But you have to believe in me when I say I did not break out Swan. On the contrary, I was trying to stop him. What? You see, it seems like my old friend the Magma Admiral made a deal with the Dragon Emperor to stage Swan's escape when in reality he was just allowed to walk away free? What? The Dragon Emperor has business making artificial blocks for its known and swan happened to be in charge of the operation yo this literally just sounds like actual one piece now hence he threatened my friend with war if he didn't free swan and return him to his home in the kingdom of rose which I assume is just dress Rosa. The Magma Admiral decided that it was not worth the casualty, so he agreed to free Swan. That does not sound like Akainu at all. When I found out about this, I tried to stop Swan from going to the second sea, but it so happens that his blocks fruit allows him to travel at high speeds through the air using strings. If you want to help bring justice and take down Swan, you're going to have to go to the second sea and find him. He will most likely be hiding as he knows that the revolutionary army is trying to find him. Okay. They want to make him pay for his tyranny now that the Marines failed to keep him restrained talk to the detective again oh shoot it looks like we're gonna actually get into some lore now all right we have to talk to this man again oh interesting he thinks swan is in the second sea i have a captain who can take you there he will meet you in middletown good luck let's go we're finally heading to the second sea before we go to the second sea though i must go to the jungle first before we head out because i need to draw i need to re-roll for devil fruit just to see what we get today because i have not done that at all this video all right let's see what we get we got the bomb fruit what the i don't think this one's a good one let me go ahead and store that of course we get nothing good without further ado let's head to the second c there's supposed to be a guy around here that's gonna help us go to the second c where is he at is this the guy experienced captain this has to be the guy i could take you to the second c would you like to go yes let's go we're going to the second c 
We made it to the second C. Let's go. No way. We finally made it. We'll go ahead and set home point right there. Anyway, guys, I'm probably going to end it off right here. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys are enjoying this Blocks Fruit series, just let me know down below because I'm definitely going to be posting every single Saturday with these Blocks Fruit videos. So make sure to turn on post notifications. And again, make sure to join the public Discord that will be linked down in the description and also will be the first comment that you see down below hope you guys enjoy the video and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out